How's it going guys? So in this video we're gonna be I'm gonna be showing y'all that butte right there. I'm not gonna show y'all much yet. But first we gotta go to the store and get a tripod because mine broke. So yeah. Alright guys, so I'll give you a little bit of an update on what's been happening. Uh Scarlet sold. We are gonna do the auction. I'll probably throw in a little bit of a video right here. She sold, she didn't bring as much as I wanted her to, but I mean, I still made triple what I paid for it, so. Um, but, we do have the new car. Coming all the way from Texas. And she's a beaut. I've had it for a little bit now. I've been, you know, trying to work out all the kinks and everything, getting it running good. And I've had to replace the alternator. I added a fuel uh, filter. I uh, I painted the engine bay in it because the engine bay looked like crap. Yeah, I mean, it's still not perfect, but, you know, she's a work in progress, but right now, we're going to get head to the Wally Mart and get us a tripod. So. Alright, let's do this. Yeah, grocery gator. I didn't hear. 76 degrees my butt. But yeah. So, this new car. It's it's a pretty car. Um, I'm not gonna say the price of it just because, you know, I'm not the type of person who brags about throwing money, but. It's, it's one of my dream cars. I'm very happy with it. I love the color of it. It's, you know, V8. It's an automatic, but, you know, I might do a manual swap eventually, but for now, it's perfect. I do, I'm probably going to have to put a uh, new interior in it, the interior that's in it right now, the, the person that we got it from said that it's original in here, which I matched the VIN numbers on them, and they didn't match it. So, you know, that's kind of disappointing. And I found out the car was originally white, which they didn't tell me that either. But, you know, and it was, the car was originally a six cylinder car, and they put a, they put a rebuild 289 in it which I mean I figured it already basically nothing on the car's original so it's not gonna hurt to swap interior or swap the wheels or anything like that which I'm not gonna put you know crazy wheels I'm gonna put something that looks like it would be factory on that car you know what I'm saying but yeah I, I just love the car put some miles on it already. I got the car with the engine and had a little over 2,000 miles on the engine. And it's got a little bit over 3,000 miles on the engine. 
I shouldn't be driving it that much, but you know, the first week going in it, I just I didn't want to leave the car. But you know, do what you gotta do. You know, the truck's been broke down. Well, not broke down, but the brake line's messed up. And, I've been having some trouble with it, but what do you expect out of an eight hundred dollar truck? But yeah, I've just been trying to fix up this car. But when you get home, get this tripod put together, and then we'll show you the car. Much better. Got the 289 V8 automatic. Got roughly around 3,000 miles on the engine. Just painted the engine bay, touched it up a little bit. Got the hooker headers, got the Elderbrock uh, intake manifold with the Elderbrock four bell carburetor. The new alternator I put on. This color is Viper Blue. Interior needs a little bit of work. Got little burn marks on there. Everything dash is all faded, but you know that seat is torn. But she's a work in progress. True dual exhaust with uh, super turbo mufflers. This car it came from Denton, Texas, where I bought it from. Pretty clean car. Burn marks on the seats though. Carpet needs it needs new carpet. But yeah. Let's take her for a spin. For a 66 car, I mean. Yeah, it's up and goes pretty good. It's got a uh, power steering. It's got disc brakes on the front. Also came with factory AC. It does need a new radio. But yeah. My grandpa owned this car before. He lived in Denton, Texas. And he had to sell it to make more room in his driveway for 
for his new Tesla he got. So, yeah, I, he gave me a real good deal on it. Um, like I said before, I'm not going to tell you all the price just because that's not who I am. But, I got a pretty good deal on it. I'll just say I paid half of what he paid for it. And I've already put almost all my paychecks into it. So, it's a work in progress, but. do need work this is all the way to the floor so they do need a little work I think they just need to be adjusted but yeah this is her I'll let my girlfriend name her her name is Bella Bella 66 I already do have shirts being designed for it so you know Back to see those soon, but yeah. Well, thanks for watching, guys. And make sure if you like the car that you like and subscribe if you want to see more content on it. Comment down below what you think I should do with it next. And I love y'all, and I'll see you guys next time.